scarcity is the keyword which can lead to millions of dollars our economy works on supply and demand there is a scarcity of a skill or a product or a service its price goes up this is how the world works now coming back to today's video today we are going to talk about what are the skill sets for which recruiters are hunting talent in the biotech industry so recently we placed seven of our students in a genomics ai company in bengaluru and all these students were placed because they were trained by technica for ai ml i'll tell you the story behind this so when i was interacting with the ceo of his company and in the recruitment team they said that first we don't have time to recruit because we are going so fast second is we are really not getting that talent in india we are outsourcing in the us and i said then you are uh, spending so much money he said yes we are spending millions of dollars on this and we don't want to so because we are burning money so we want somebody who can do this for us so i said okay tell me what are the skills you need right so they gave me a set of i think 10 skill set but uh, more or less the seven were the most important ones so i'm going to tell you today the seven skill sets which ai in biology companies are looking for desperately as of today in 2025 now i'm not saying that these skills will always be relevant but right now for the next 11 to 12 months these skills are definitely going to be hot and if you pursue them if you learn it definitely you can get a job high paying job in ai ml in these companies and they're not bothered what age you are all they're looking at somebody who has talent good understanding logical power and you're hired okay so the first thing which they are badly looking for or hunting for is machine learning and deep learning experts in biology now somebody who has a good understanding of the central dogma of bio molecular biology he has a good understanding of biochemistry and then they should have coding knowledge in ml and deep learning knowledge. Now machine learning and deep learning is helping transform the existing bioinformatics as we speak by enabling data driven predictions. Earlier this was never possible today it is possible. Today AI is allowing the scientists to recognize a pattern and do some complex analysis. And that is why recruiters are hunting for individuals who have good expertise in machine learning and deep learning in biology right here in India. Now the second thing which I would like to highlight the second skill set which they are looking for is data analysis and data mining. Now we all know we have natural language processing chatbots or chat GPTs but when we look at bioinformatics it is generating a lot of data massive data sets and they are looking at people who can analyze these data sets for valuable insights and they are looking for candidates who can work on large scale biological data they can identify the trends and extract actionable conclusions and that is where they are looking for data mining ai engineers or data analysis experts more or less you can call them data scientists in biology right so what exactly is the key skill issue they are looking for they are looking for statistical analysis hypothesis testing r and python uh, language expertise and advanced data mining techniques they are also looking at people who have supervised learning experience neural networks natural language processing and reinforcement learning experience so these are the skill sets which they are looking at now the third major skill set which they are looking at is bioinformatics tools expertise and algorithm development and they're not looking for paid softwares if you have action, uh, you know experience with free open source softwares that's more than enough so the development of an optimization of algorithm for specific bioinformatic task is like it's very difficult like sequence alignment protein structure prediction genetic variation analysis all of this is in high demand and that is why recruiters are looking for people who know how to develop algorithms who have the knowledge of algorithms such as blast smith waterman cluster w as well as programming languages such as python c++ and java and all of that by the way you can learn in biotechnica because we have training programs internships and projects available on all of these right so that's the third key skill which the recruiters are looking at now the fourth one actually is in more most demand and even as a cro biotechnica is also now on delivering these services as next gen sequencing data analysis and genomics now ngs technology has been there since a long time now that's the core of genomic research actually but after the data comes up somebody who has to handle that data 
vast output of big data and analyze and that is where they're looking at somebody who has an understanding of genomic sequencing technologies alignment tools such as bowtie bwa variant calling such as gat k and genome sld so if you have this skill set definitely you're getting hired and i can place you one shot in any of these companies if you've learned these four or five skills which i shared till now now the sixth skill which they are looking for is cloud computing and big data biology technologies as you know storing this amount of data is hu you know, a huge problem and you need to store we need to process vast quantity of quantities of genomic data clinical data we need to make sure that it is safe and at the same time we need people who can handle cloud computers such as aws to scale up processing and improve the computational efficiency right they are looking at people who know aws google cloud microsoft azure hadoop spark and distributed computing so if you learn this because you are in a lot of demand. But now, the interesting part is, these are all IT tools, but a biologist has to learn, right? Science is all about crossing the boundary. The more you cross boundary, the more growth happens, right? So that's the fifth one which we have got. Now the sixth one which we have is data visualization and interpretation. Of course, you are analyzing data, but how do you interpret? How do you visualize it? So that's where you need to learn W, ggplot, matplotlib, seaborn and you should have a strong understanding of biological data also that's very important so communicating complex biological data is very important uh, it has to be in an imperitable manner and then uh, recruiters are looking for candidates who can create meaningful visual representations of data that can help understand the patterns right so that's about data visualization tools you should learn for now the seventh one which is the most demand and that is ai ml in drug discovery ai in ml is significantly accelerating the drug dis discovery process even in biotechnica we are working on a lot of molecules patented molecules we'll be working at so right from predicting the molecular interaction to optimizing the drug candidate to repurposing the existing drug candidate to testing the different combinations of drugs and concentrations and testing their viability all of that right here we are doing and of course you can learn that so this field is growing continuously and it is leading to a lot of uh, cost saving because now you don't have to play in the lab you're playing inside a computer so uh, recruiters are looking at someone who has deep learning expertise in structure activity relationships chem informatics molecular docking and using ai for compound screening and compound repurposing so these are the seven skill sets which i could jot down in that meeting with the ceo and the recruiters now the question is how do you learn these skill set the answer is very simple you have already got a very good understanding of biology but you need to learn how to implement ai into biology and that is where i am sitting i'm sitting with a team of 17 ai ml and bioinformatics scientists right now in biotechnica cro and you can come and learn with us either you can come offline and learn or you can avail this uh, entire uh, services free of cost also through the scholarship which we have available otherwise you can do internships with us otherwise you can do hands on training with us online projects are available you can avail so all you have to do is click the link in the description in the comment section and uh, talk to one of our ai ml in biology specialist understand how you can learn this and then Biotechnica will be able to place you in all of these companies. And if you are subscribed to Biotechnica's channel, you will see so many placement stories, success stories happening with these companies. So what are you waiting for? The chance is here. The chance is now. The chance is to jump and believe that you're going to get there. Biotechnica is always there to support you, guide you, nurture you and help you achieve the right success destination which you always deserve thank you so much for watching this video see you soon in the next one till then keep shining take care bye bye